Okay, so I can't find a map, so I'm going to try this again. Actually, what I'm going to do is I'm going to walk back to the ship. I'm going to use that as an edit point. For the first time I walk back here. This is getting boring, I know. I'm looking for a way around that blockage up here. This thing, the needle on it, barely even moves anymore. And back to where these guys are. I feel like an idiot because I can't find my way through here, but I just looked online. I can't find a map. If I could find like an overhead map of this area, it would be a breeze. I can, I can read and use maps very well. Or if this was a nice, bright, sunshiny day on this planet, it, I've got to be walking right by the solution. with anyone. I'm not seeing anything that I can interact with, period. I'm starting to get frustrated. Oh my god, I'm an idiot. I thought that dude was just like standing there being an idiot. No idea he was. No idea that he was there to uh, give me a boost. I'm probably walking around in circles up here too, ain't I? Stay put. I think I found something. 
Where did I found something? Something that way. Come on, let me find what I'm looking for. Okay. That led me to a cliff edge. Okay, there's definitely something this direction. This looks like the way I just walked up from. This is getting frustrating. You can't see three feet in front of your face. Well, four or five feet in front of your face. You got this, looks like a primitive fucking Geiger counter to find your way. Only, it's really not doing its job. Wish I could just cast this dude off of a cliff. Okay, now it's pointing towards something. Okay, it was pointing to something in this direction. Now is it pointing me in this direction? Where the fuck am I supposed to go? This, I've been here before. I have no way of getting up over this. Yeah, I'm definitely detecting something this direct. Okay. some guys. Let's get going. I'd like to know why their uh, armor looks so much like samurai armor. This over here looks like where I need to go. There we go. Uh, 
That's definitely an artificial structure. Interesting device with the way the needles on it work. It reminds me of the way the needles on it work, reminds me of uh, seeing people dowels for water with two bent pieces of metal, one in each hand. I don't personally believe in dowsing, but people do it. Even in this modern day and age, a lot of places, that's how they decide where to dig their wells. Big companies, they'll hire people to douse for water. Is this supposed, this sure looks like it. Is this supposed to be the uh, same ship from the first Alien movie? I'm guessing it is. Whew. Tell you what, this is going to be one long ass episode, even when I edit out some of the spots where I got lost forever. But I think as soon as I get done with this. I'll probably make this my last recording of the day so that I can go ahead and get stuff uploaded. I only got like two days a week I can actually do recording, so I record like several episodes of this, several episodes of that, and then I upload them all and then put them on schedule for the rest of the week. I had a whole month's worth of stuff done when I did the Tomb Raider series, but it wasn't my fault. Now it's our property. Salvage rights. Then we'll take what we can and come back. Have a look around. See what else is here. Tracks. What is it? I can see that. Shit. I can't hear her at all. Let's find out. I'll find the beacon and shut it off. Don't want anybody else finding this place. Foster, Heist, check out the camera below. See if he's got a map now. Okay, I think a woman got infected this time around, didn't she? Okay. It's pointing me towards that doorway over there. It's 
somewhere back here. Now, is this being told from the perspective of the guy in the jail cell or whoever got infected? Am I going to get face hugged? Kind of cool looking. How would I know how to shut down the beacon? Let's see what that achievement was for. Not the first. Turned off the beacon. Okay. Figured there'd be a better explanation than that, but. I don't know what happened, but the beacon stopped broadcasting. On my way. Can't really run. I wish I could run to make this go faster, but. Yeah, well, they got that up and running fast. You know, I'm not trying to complain about how they're doing things here, but, like, even in the first Alien, they took a look at that creature right there, but they didn't really do much with it. You'd think one of the first things you'd want to do is take a tissue sample so that when you got back to civilization, they could figure out the genetics of such a thing. I mean, the first time you encounter a, a 12 foot tall alien corpse, you might want to take a DNA sample. Take pictures. Maybe even take the whole body back with you if you can, even if you got to cut it up into little pieces. I mean, they certainly wanted Xenomorphs back alive. Or, at least intact, so that they could study them. You would think that they'd want that body, too. I wonder how long these eggs have been sitting here. Ten thousand, twenty thousand, a hundred thousand years. And they're still viable and able to spit out face huggers. Must be some kind of really interesting metabolism these things have. Yeah, I was watching a documentary on the first Aliens movie. At first they wanted those eggs when they opened up, it was instead of being an X shape, it was just going to be a straight line. But people said that it looked too much like a vagina and that it would be banned in countries where Catholicism was the main religion. So they changed it to an X so that it wouldn't look like a vagina anymore. I don't know. I like the X looking eggs better, but that's just my opinion. K 
Okay, I still can't do anything, but it says door locked. Okay, it's saving. Come on. Everything. Where's your ship? If we can break the comms lockdown, what are the codes to bring it in on auto? Not happening, Marlo. Is that right? Well, you know where I am. Plan B. Set it up. Whatever's happening, I want in. Okay. This is good. Got something you need. Let's hope this thing works. It's an animal. Animals are afraid of fire. Hope you're right. Come on, search. There we go. Okay. All right. I've got a plan to trap it. Take a transit car and move Ricardo in the Sistex fire. I'll coordinate from here. Okay, where is the save point at? I hear it, but I don't see it. There it is. Alright, this is where I'm going to cut this video. Hostels nearby. That's alright. This is where I'm going to cut this video for today. Um, this particular video is going to be long and boring, but I hope you guys can get through it. And I hope you enjoy. I mean, if you're wanting to see a step-by-step walkthrough, this will be pretty comprehensive, even, if, even how to get lost at times. So if you like, let me know. Leave a comment. Um, hit the like button. Interact in some way. I've been getting a couple of dislikes here lately. So hopefully that doesn't continue to be a trend. But anyway, I'll talk to you guys later. And thanks for watching.